What's up, YouTube? This is Ron Three Two Three Gaming, and I'm making me another video. And today, I'll be showing y'all the Spider-Man Web of Shadows DS version bad ending. And you might be saying, a bad ending? Are you serious? There can be no bad ending. Well, yes, there is a bad ending. And how can you get the bad ending? Well, you see, you gotta help Green Goblin twice. And you might be asking, do you got to complete the game with Black Spider-Man? No, it doesn't matter what Spider-Man that you complete with. You just gotta help Green Goblin twice, and you get the bad ending. I guess nobody helped Green Goblin twice, and that's the reason why nobody got the bad ending. I searched it up on YouTube, I ain't see no bad ending. I mostly got bad endings on... I mean, I only see bad endings on console versions on YouTube, but not on a DS version. So, today, I'll be showing you all the bad ending, but I had to get through the fight with the symbiote leader. I'm going to be playing with the Black Spider-Man most of the time. And, yeah, let's continue with this video.
Venom might have been as surprised as everybody else that there was a super symbiote capable of this kind of destruction. But I was even more surprised to find out once the big one was gone that I was in charge. Spider-Man, we will follow you. Spider-Man, the city is yours. And that, that is very interesting. Great power, great responsibility. Nah, great power's plenty. So folks, that is the bad ending. And the reason why I didn't like die or lose any energy because I did use a cheat. And the reason why I did use a cheat so I get the reason why I did use a cheat is so that I get through this video fast as possible. Cause I didn't want to make the video like 12 minutes long. But yes, that's the bad ending. No clickbait. You can play it for yourself. Just help Green Goblin twice and you'll get the bad ending. But until then, that's the end of this playthrough. And I'm gonna move on to the next playthrough. See ya. Peace.